right, so here it goes. We're, uh, we got into this trade right now, okay, with uh, four contracts. Uh, here is the first uh, logging trade. This is the second uh, entry, okay, so plus four. So the market has been doing nothing right now, it's just stalling. Okay, so this was a good trade, but I couldn't get it. Okay, so this is the morning. We shorted the market, everything was aligned, and uh, we exit uh, one lot here and we let the other one run. And uh, we exit uh, around here. So then we made another short, just one contract winner, the other one didn't win. This one stopped out completely. Okay, so this one tried to work, but it stopped out. I closed the trade. So right now we're going back to the highs. Remember, we're still in this consolidation area, but the market is really trying to push. But uh, let's see what the market does for us today. Okay, that why I entered this trade, right? Why I entered this trade? You see the see the high momentum in the Nasdaq. The Nasdaq is moving to the upside. We see this high volume in the micro ES2 along with the Nasdaq. You see this. This is with three continuous prints. This is very high volume. So this is conviction, guys. So this is what you want to trade. Okay. So this is what you need to be chasing. So the market did, didn't want to go down, so it went up. Okay. We continue monitoring the time and sales. Okay. Because the time and sales is everything. Here is where you you need to check if you're gonna continue in the trade or you can exit the trade. Okay, let's see what happens. We're still in this congested area. Yeah, the market just tagged this perpendicular line here and the market is just hitting it and we're going back again, so we never know. Still congested, right? not, not moving to the high. It's in accumulation and distribution. We'll wait and see. Okay, we see buyers in the tape. Now the Nasdaq is hitting this, this high. This is a very uh, important area for the Nasdaq because it, it hasn't gone over. You need to go to 10,700. Uh, 10, we see a lot of commitment. I see a lot of volume. This guy's trying to push. See buyers. More buyers in the same second. More buyers. This is what we're looking, guys, for the buyers to continue. In, in mirror rule for rules for the short. We need to see the sellers pushing in. You know. Come on guys, we need to see a buy rush. Still struggling a bit. Market closes in 45 minutes guys. You see, why, that's why you need the prints guys. You need to see the prints. You need to see what's going on. You need to see conviction. With a plain bar, you cannot see that. You need to see the volume. You need to see the correlation. Where are the sisters going? Where is the, where is the market going? You see all these buyers, 420. Okay, we see uh, in the same second print, one, two, three. It's in the same second. It's one uh, over 500 lots. Yeah, we're gonna get one out. Come on guys.
Target build. Okay, one out. Okay, and exit the other Target one. build. Always exit a little bit because you know uh, the market can turn around in a time, you know, it's, uh, especially the, the ES is very volatile. These guys can really do crazy things, you never know. You move your stops, you know, protect your, your position so you won't get uh, cut off with your, you know, pants down. The installer right now is the NASDAQ. You already stopped here. Ooh, lots of selling. And exit. Target oh. build. Target build. Okay, guys, done for the day. No more trading for today. The market is closing in. 40 minutes so I don't think the market is going higher from here or going lower well you never know but for me it's more than enough okay guys so if you like the video uh, give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel you can contact me in the link in the description of the video if you want more information of the system uh, thanks for watching guys have a great day